Okay, so I haven't made a video in a long time. I know that's, I say that every time, but I swear, it's going to start making more of them. Um, my daughter does competition cheer, and we had cheerleading season, so that's finally over with, and I have a few weeks by myself. Yay! Okay, so my rant today about the diabetes, which is about the carb counting when you have to go out um, either to a restaurant or you're at a place and somebody's got something and you're not quite sure what the carbs are because I have to put the carbs in the insulin pump. So, you know, I guess it, well, you have to count the carbs anyway, even if you have to inject yourself and you're a type 1 diabetic. But I'm pretty good. Uh, I have a little book that I carry with me and like an app. But sometimes I don't want to go looking through my book or type in to find out the carbs. So it would be much easier just to ask wherever I am if they happen to know the carb count. So let me explain some things that have happened to me when I've done this. And this is the thing that annoys me about people not knowing about type 1 diabetes and what you need to do. It's not type 2 where, you know, you don't have to monitor as much. You know, I don't have to test every time I need to consume something and I need to know the carb so I can put it in my pump so that I can have the right amount of insulin. Okay, so the first time I went to a Starbucks with my daughter and I got the little Starbucks book that's there and I'm looking in it and I'm trying to find what I'm gonna get and the lady that works there goes, oh honey, don't look at that. You don't wanna look at that. You don't wanna even know. And my first response was like, I need to know and I have to look at it because I have to know how many carbs I need to put into my insulin pump. And she still went, yeah, you still don't want to look at it. No, no, you don't understand. I need to know the amount of carbs that I'm going to consume in my drink to put in my insulin pump. It's not like I'm just some, ha, 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 how many carbs? And I haven't asked since that time, which was months and months ago. And I've just figured out, well, I'll just figure it out myself or take a great educated guess. Well, the other night, my husband and my daughter and me are walking in downtown Charleston. And we walk past this cute little fudge ice cream shop. And they're in there picking out their fudge. And I'm looking around like a sad puppy thinking, great, I'll have a diabetic coma if I consume all of this. So I happened to say to the guy, uh, by chance, you don't know what the carb count is in the fudge. But meanwhile, I should say, I'm dressed like in this frilly pink dress. I guess I looked a little, ha ha ha, how many carbs? I don't want to eat carbs. <laughs> I don't want to get fat. <laughs> I guess they thought it was that. Uh, the guy originally, though, was nice. And he said, oh, you got me there. Let me find out. And he asked this other lady. And the lady looks over at me. And she goes, I don't know. So then he goes and proceeds to ask the other lady, who I guess is in charge of everything, and she said, well, if you have to ask that, then I guess you don't need to be eating it. Excuse me? But me being polite like I am, I said, uh, no, no, I just want to know because I have an insulin pump and I have to put my carbs in. Oh, well, it's like 90% sugar, so I guess you shouldn't be eating it anyway. <sighs> Are you serious? It's not. I can have sugar. I'm not allergic to sugar. I can't, this drives me absolutely insane. So I left unhappy, knowing that I could find out the carbs anywho, if I wanted to, which I did later on my phone. But the point of it was, is the reactions I get when I ask it. Because nobody knows, people just think you're like, carbs, they're bad, I don't wanna have any carbs, shouldn't have any carbs. Not realizing that, no, I'm asking because I need to actually use them so that I can eat the food, drink whatever I'm drinking, so that I can live. So, anyhow, folks, uh, that was my rant for today about counting carbs out in public. I'm sure I'll have many, many more awesome rants about this. On a lighter note, though, I did get my Etsy store up and running with my diabetic jewelry, and it's um, all made from diabetic supplies to make the awareness of type 1 diabetes. And you can find me on Facebook at shop julie baby and i also have an etsy store called shop julie baby and the line is called type one Mwah!